uh, my initial idea of psychic wards were like, kind of like, you know those drug things where the people they take people after they have drugs, and it's like really nice. And it's like, they got the pools and they're like, oh, find new hobbies that can distract you from being uh, so sad you take drugs. It's like, uh, it, it was nothing like that. Well, I kind of thought they would be kind of controlling. Because it had gone from therapy to like in a hospital ER, because obviously therapy didn't help. And then a psychic ward. They wake you up at like 8.50, but I'm not sure what the time was because they didn't have clocks, and then you would do like therapy stuff, and then after that, they would. I think they had like call time, and then it was lunch, visiting hours, dinner. A uh, psychic ward is sort of like where they take kids who um, have reached out for help and kids who have not done drastic things who like they take them there and they're like I bet y'all sleep here now you have roommates you can't take sharp objects into your room which was actually stated they're like you can't take pencils into your room because there have been kids who have broken them in half and using them to cut their sides and things like that so I was like oh how lovely yeah my room it was like a baby blue who was pretty big had two beds. The rooms, all of them were like white, white and super bright, and I hated it, I hated it, I hated it. They're like, let's find new activities in the small white room where there's too many people to breathe in here, all grouped around this one singular leader. Yeah, pretty much. The psych ward encouraged me to get out of my comfort zone. I Learn to unicycle, play tennis, learn to play clarinet. It's like, I had no choice going there because I had tried to kill myself. So it was like, ordered, or kind of like a government forced thing where I had to go. Um, but someone who wants to go, it could be helpful. You make a lot of friends, but also you get a lot of help, so it's good. Most of the time, the stuff they give you there really works. I don't remember there being like a choice to go outside. There might have been though, but I don't remember that well, so. Going, like, what what's it like going into a, a psychic ward, like trying to get yourself admitted? It didn't help me. I know that it can help some people. So if you personally are trying to get admitted and you want help and you don't think therapy is good enough, do it, absolutely do it. I didn't want to go. So I was forced, it did not help because I felt imprisoned. So instead of being like, being like helped, it sort of just imprisoned me. If you like, if you want to go yourself, it could be very helpful.